Buzzy. We gotta talk about some. How come you ain't been burying your poops? Mm. What's up? Toy Insanity GPK Wednesday. Garbage Fell Kids Cookbook Recipe Number 5. This is Buzzy. Number 5 is gonna be Poop Cookies. In honor of <laughs> National Cookie Day, December 4th, we're making Potty Scotty's Poop Cookies. I got an original Potty Scotty 14A from 1985, original Series 1. You can see they took away his uh, his tan. I don't know why, but I also want to show you this. Where are they now? Potty Scotty. Oh, grown up. He became a plumber. I always did like Potty Scotty. Because look, he's just about cleanliness. He's got the cleaning bar, the plunger, the scrubber, and the A jacks. <laughs> I don't really like the gruesome ones. I like the clean ones, even though he's making poop cookies. Look. Look what I found down there. I come up with all my best ideas when I'm alone in the loo, relaxing on my porcelain throne. Like the singing toilet that played Tinkle Tinkle Little Star, or the prankster party with the disappearing toilet paper. What about the toilet bowl that was also a fish tank? That one was the best. Well, until someone flushed. But these amazing poop cookies are my greatest inspiration. I roll out a chocolatey sugar cookie dough and twist it into my favorite turdtastic shape. They look so realistic you may think twice before taking a bite. Pure potty genius. <laughs> turdtastic turdtainment on the Insanity channel. Now listen, I've already got... <laughs> I've got one and a half cups flour plus three quarter cups unsweetened cocoa powder in here. And then in here, I got one and a half sticks of butter, unsalted, uh, and sugar. I want a quarter cup sugar. Forgot the egg. Forgot the egg. Two teaspoons vanilla extract. Yeah, I want to show you this. Adam's best. You know, that's funny because look, Adam Baum, what's up? In uh, baking powder. I forgot that. Combine the flour, cocoa, and salt. Oh yeah, there's a pinch of salt in here. In a stand mixer, fitted with a paddle. <laughs> okay, in the stand mixer with a powder. Beat the butter and sugar, that's the butter and sugar for three minutes on high. Okay, I gotta get a spatula and also the egg. Uh, but what are we gonna do next? Then uh, add the egg and vanilla. Beat one minute more. Reduce the mixture to low. Add the flour and cocoa poo mixture. Then we're gonna gather the dough into a ball and wrap it in plastic. Refrigerate two hours. <sighs> guess I gotta do it. I guess I gotta do it. <laughs> then we're gonna roll out coily turds. <laughs> Body Scotty's poop cookies. GBK Insanity, thumbs up, BRB. Okay, I got that. <laughs> Body Scotty, poop cookies. All right, I got uh, the egg. I got this, because it's not really grabbing the butter and sugar. Well, let's have this continue. Vanilla. Atom bombs on vanilla extract. And an egg. Reduce to low. Well, that's off. Hang on. National Cookie Day, and in honor of Potty Scotty, a.k.a. Jason Basin.
Okay, I just <clears throat> I refrigerated it for a few minutes in the pot. I don't have two hours to spare. Kidding. Uh, anyway, let's see it. Hang on. Yeah, look like turds. What's he? Uh, so then you just make coily snakes. <laughs> Potty scatties. Poop cookies. So you see how it's falling apart just a tiny bit. I think that that's the whole thing. If you had refrigerated a little more, a little longer. <laughs> uh, they would fall apart less easily. Kitty! Come here! Kitty! Kitty! Pretty realistic looking. I should put something a little chunky in it, you know, a little bit, a little bit of peanuts, <laughs> maybe a little bit of whole grain cereal. Oh, there is a. I definitely would throw in some cereal if the other cookie recipe. I think there's only two cookie recipes. The other cookie recipe is cereal cookies, and we'll surely do that on National Cereal Day. <laughs> Who knows? Who even knows at this point? Looks like little cat turds, kitty. My cat's not coming over. Okay, thumbs up. BRB. <laughs> uh, okay, I think I made 32. Check it out. My poop cook is bringing all the flies to the yard. Because they're like, that poop's better than yours. Get out of here. If you, um, if you have a pet feline cat, this is exactly what their little kitty piles look like. Man, I just went for it. Okay, the only thing left to do is bake it. But I was thinking, you know, in the sequel, in the sequel, cookbook, they should get Catty Kathy. Uh, I think the bee name is actually Kitty Litter. And, and, and make a version of this. Or maybe Fudge. Or maybe Fudge. But then get something that kind of looks like cat litter to put around it. I don't know. Some kind of cereal or nuts and powdered sugar. That'd be cool. Okay. Uh, anyway, thumbs up. BRB. I made so many. Listen, and I couldn't resist the cat litter idea. Kitty! Come up! This is crushed up. Cap'n Crunch. And a little bit of crushed up. Cinnamon Toast Crunch. Because if you don't know me, I'm also cereal insanity. Look at these. Pretty good. Pretty good. Okay. Let me get the card. We'll do a rating. There's three points of rating. One, flavor. I am not the biggest chocolate fan in the world. But I'm still going to give this a nine. Nine out of ten. They're, they're good. A second rating is fun. Okay. Was it too difficult? Was it too uh, boring? Fun. This was fun. And boy, do they look real. I'm going to go, I'm going to say 10 out of 10. I'm going to say this might be the funnest one in here. Don't know yet. We're only on number five. And then the third rating is relating a classic GPK, GPK character to, you know, what recipe would be, really be appropriate for Potty Scotty. And I think it fits a bill. Solid. Solid. Get it. 9.5 out of 10. I almost did a 10 out of 10, but there's just so many that could have had. There's so many toilet-related characters. 
But Potty Scotty is like my top three characters of all garbage pop kids. Look at those. Look at those popping in the sun. Poop cookies. GPK cookbook recipe number five.